Hey folks, Matt from IreLyImage.com. Interesting article over on top, the online photographer. That's Mike's website if you want to check it out. Always some great articles, some daily reads, thoughts and things to ponder. And today he's talking about printing. So today's uh, Wednesday open mic. Well, I guess today's Thursday, so I was reading yesterday's post. Um, my printing problem. And this is interesting because he talks about how uh, he had somebody write in and ask what about all the adventures he was doing in inkjet printing. And he said uh, his response, to he said he, he opted to answer honestly. And this rang true for me, which is why I found this very interesting. I tend to fixate on the cost of materials, paper, and especially ink. This is a psychological problem like my irrational fear of dentists. I sometimes cannot talk myself into keeping appointments. But knowing doesn't make it any less difficult to deal with. So um, this tends to be... I think my issue as well, I've had many printers over the years and I tend not to uh, use them because the printers themselves, you can get it a good deal. They're kind of lost leaders. And then you go to put the ink in and that's where they're really killing you. And I'm always thinking about how much ink am I? It's like, be like driving a Ferrari and watching the gas gauge just drop as you're hitting the gas. And that's what I, the way I kind of feel about printing. Um, one of the viewers on, or readers on his channel says, uh, read your response. I too get fixated on ink and paper uh, costs. A set of 12 inks for my Canon Pro will cost 350 given I only paid 450 via a special at B&H for the printer. I can't bring myself to nearly double that cost of buying a full set of inks. So again, this is my problem. It's, 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 it, 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 I don't know. I think in the per run costs, it's probably, not that expensive. I've done the math before, but I think uh, the initial outlay is a lot, and then you know you're spending it. Whereas you can go and get a Pro Lab, or even you know Costco has basically the same printer machines as the Pro Labs, and if they don't run it to your satisfaction, they'll run it again. They're even running the large inkjet from Epson, the high quality with the uh, ultra chrome inks and whatnot on their larger prints. So to me, the cost of printing is more economical to do it from Costco than it is to actually own these printers myself anymore. Uh, that viewer go, uh, reader goes on to say, um, the tanks included with the printer ran dry long before I was near being proficient with the printer, so all 70 pounds of the great hulking howitzer, or cannon, uh, sits on a table in my office like a huge black paperweight gathering dust and mocking me. I know this uh, exactly because I've had so many printers that I would use them and I never get around to using um, to purchasing a second set of inks and continuing to use them. And they sit there and gather dust. And I, it's this mental thing in my head about the cost of printing, the paper, the ink. And it can be very expensive. And as also if you tend to, to fiddle-faddle with it and you're not happy with the first print or the second print and you're trying to tweak that, then the cost gets even more expensive. And um, I think, um, like Mike says here, part of the anxiety is my background conviction that I'm being exploited a grittier word is cheated by ink prices. Falsely high ink prices are part of the common model for making money selling printers, like Gillette sticking it to you for their good but way, way overpriced razor blade cartridges. And I think this too factors in in the sense of you feel, you, I, I don't think these prices are uh, justified. I don't think uh, they're necessary. I think they're overly inflated. I think there's huge margins on them, and I think they're getting us at the cash register. So that kind of irritates me too. And I think that's why I stick to Costco. When I want to do a large print, I can get a beautiful Gicle, uh inkjet print from a nice Epson high-end with ultra-chrome inks from Costco for a very good price. And if it doesn't come off how I like it, they're always happy to redo it. So it's a one-off, little investment up front, and I think it effectively is probably no less ex uh, expensive to go to Costco for me than it is um, to run it at home. There is some fun to running at home, but again, it's an expense and you got to budget for it. You got to be willing to accept those costs. And I think it's a mental thing. I may actually be able to sit and if I had budgeted the amount and knew it was going to be and just try to get past it, but it just seems to be an ongoing mental thing about the price of printing at home. I'd like to throw that back to you guys. It was interesting to see Mike saying he thinks exactly the same thing and why he doesn't use his printer and some other of his readers chiming in. What do you guys think? What's the general consensus here? Do you guys, are, are you the same way? Do you have printers at home that are sitting collecting dust because you just find the cost of ink is too much to get your head around? It's too unpalatable. You feel like you're getting ripped off? Or do you 
just prefer the convenience of going to um, Costco or and Pro Shop, wherever you go and you're happy with the prints. Not getting into debate here because we can easily debate where you should go to get prints. But I've seen studies done where some of the cheapest drugstores do a better print in the end than some of the best pro labs when you go and get 12 of the same print done and then evaluate them for quality. So um, let's not discuss that part. Just what would you rather do? Would you rather run a printer at home and you enjoy that? It's basically the digital darkroom. Or do you prefer to go out Costco or somewhere else and get your prints done? And why? Let's discuss it. Uh, are you more of a Mike and me kind of guy where it's too expensive and you got printers sitting at home with dust? Um, are your printers uh, running around the clock? Are you using them? Do you have one or two or several printers and you're happy with it and you find the cost okay? Just curious to see what you guys have to say. Uh, comments below. What's your experience? What's your thoughts on this? Let's let's discuss this. I'm curious to hear what you guys have to say, what your feelings are on this. Uh, are Mike and I in the minority here and his few readers that chimed in and said the same thing? Or are we in the majority? Looking forward to hearing from you guys. Thanks for tuning in. Stay tuned. We'll be back soon here at artoftheimage.com.